Today's video is going to be a sequence of maneuvers that move you through DeFi on Cardano. We're gonna go from a decentralized exchange to a borrowing and lending platform, back to an exchange, discussing strategies and showcasing the power of Cardano's DeFi ecosystem. This will be a multi-part sequence strategical video outline. My last major deep dive that I'm gonna put out here on YouTube that take you through step-by-step -step a series and a sequence of events so you can sort of follow along. Not that you're gonna do this exact sequence and series because this is particular to my specific strategies, but you'll be able to understand the power and the leverage that you can gain participating in the Cardano ecosystem of DeFi. If you are set up for a catalyst, if you've watched my video on that, how to get your wallet ready for the snapshot, I'd hope that you would vote for me in creating DeFi education content courses for the community. Now I'm gonna explain briefly my strategy. We're gonna go in a moment to the ViFi Dex. Then we're gonna go from ViFi Dex to Liquid Finance. We might then go to MinSwap DEX, okay? So it's like one DEX to a money lending platform, back to a DEX. And in between, I'm gonna talk about several strategies and options according to why we're going in these directions. So first off, why buy finance? Right now in buy finance, this is specific to me and my portfolio and what I have going on. I have been leveraging the vaults on buy finance. So vault staking. So if you have a project like Cornucopius is what we're going to be focusing on today. Vi Finance is where you could stake, is one of the options where you can actually supply your Cornucopius into a vault and it will gain rewards. So I've been doing this now for quite some time, staking my Cornucopius and harvesting these rewards. A few weeks ago on Liquid Finance, we voted in the governance tab to open a market for Cornucopius in liquid finance. So my strategy right now, what I'm gonna take you through to showcase the power of Cardano DeFi is not only that I've been leveraging a DEX like Vi Finance to supply my Cornucopius tokens there and been gaining rewards for quite some time, I'm gonna now take that Cornucopius, I'm gonna harvest it, we're gonna do it, we're gonna see it, we're gonna look at it, I'm gonna harvest it off the exchange, off the DEX, we're going to then supply that in the market created at Liquid Finance. And then we're gonna think and discuss options of what to do with that supply of Cornucopius on Liquid Finance. We could take a loan against it. We're gonna do that. We're gonna take a loan against the Cornucopius tokens in real time to show you the sequence. And then it's a matter of what do we do with the loan? There are several strategies that we can discuss. We're gonna go through the process of what it could be from taking something moving it, harvesting it, bringing it into another application in Cardano DeFi, and then leveraging that asset even further. What I might explain in certain times in this video might seem a little complex, but I promise you it's a natural thing. You're, you're dealing with your money, you're dealing with your investments, you're dealing with projects you love, you're dealing with an ecosystem, you're entering in an arena where you should be in love with the arena. So everything you're gonna hear me talk about are projects that I absolutely love, that I am behind, that I support. And that's another aspect to Cardano DeFi is that your participation in Cardano DeFi helps the entire ecosystem. So it supports the entire ecosystem. I don't have a finance background, traditional finance or anything like this. So all that is to say that you can do this, okay? You can at least understand the progress and the opportunities that Cardano DeFi has to offer before you actually take part. Everything you're gonna see me do here has been on the heels of two years worth of research prior to even participating, and now I've been participating in DeFi for two years in the Cardano ecosystem. I, I have been helping people in the ecosystem for quite some time now, um, and I'm just a regular average Joe that understands the power of Cardano DeFi. So without any further ado, let's get into it. So here we are on Vi Finance. Okay, so as you can see, I have a few vaults. So you earn copy, stake copy. 
and I have, these are my vaults that I have staked only. So if I untoggle staked only, you can see all the vaults that are available for you to participate. And Vi Finance has several, okay? They have a lot. I see it, and, and if you are participating in one of their vaults, it'll show you actually in real time that your vault is running. I have several positions going on with Drip, for instance. Um, and then, you know, so some of these staking vaults have been closed, right? Like there's an old Cornucopius vault that was, that was closed. Um, and so when you're looking at this, and PBX is another one that was closed that I was using. When you're looking at this vault, okay, we'll kind of pop back up to the top. When you're looking at these vaults, you can even click open only, like only you only want to see the ones that are opened. You can click just the ones that have NFTs, okay? You can actually stake NFTs and earn tokens, okay? Um, you can stake liquidity provider tokens, okay? And, but what I use it for, okay, I'm going to go into the ones that I have staked only, okay? So you can see that I have a Noom vault that was a 365 day vault, so a 12 month vault. So it's closed to the public now, uh, but I entered this vault prior to it being closed. And so I still have right now, I have 49 days remaining in this particular vault to where I'll be able to then harvest. Okay, and as you can see, we're focusing on the strategy here. I'm taking you through a sequence, a strategy, where I'm going to harvest the cornucopius tokens here and then bring them into liquid finance. We're gonna look at that together, all right? And so here we are with Cornucopius. Right now, if I look at this, the vault is 92.75% completed, okay? And you can, you, can, you can just toggle your cursor here in this bar to understand how long the vault has to go to be completed. And so as this vault is getting near its end, I'm going to harvest and leverage this asset cornucopius tokens uh, even more, okay? So as you can see, I have 400,000 cornucopius staked, and this is what I've been earning so far since I've initially been staking cornucopius in this particular vault, okay? And you can click into the details. It shows you that there are 700,000 copy that they are paying out. Um, there's a harvest fee that you'll get when we actually harvest and what we're going to do right now in real time is we are going to relinquish and liquidate this asset so we're going to harvest so to harvest your copy and stake tokens 3.5 ada will be sent to the vault okay and two will be turned along with your cnt so we're going to send that we're going to have to sign the transaction So it sees we have the, it shows we have the transaction submitted and we're just going to give it some time. Right now what's going on is the transaction is being processed and you can see that our vault was eliminated, okay? And therefore, we have successfully harvested our Vi Finance, or our, on Vi Finance, our Cornucopius position, okay? On Vi Finance. So this is what that would look like, right? Your vault just sort of disappears. And when the uh, transaction completely processes, you will see those cornucopius tokens, the ones that you initially staked, plus all of the tokens that you are gaining together as one, okay? And you can check all that on Cardano Scan, which is a Cardano Transaction Explorer, okay? And so we'll just give that a second and we'll jump back into it when that, when that happens. Okay, so while that transaction is taking place, give it some time. Grab a cup of coffee, grab some tea. I'm drinking some tea here, some coffee, whatever you want. Just take a moment, okay, relax, and let this transaction happen. And one of the beautiful things about what goes on in Cardano DeFi, different than Ethereum DeFi, is the prices are de deterministic. And so you know exactly the fee you're going to be paying for that process of fee structure regardless of time or congestion different than ethereum okay so 
I think our I think we've allowed enough time to go by right there. It's just a small amount of time, not much time. And now we have those cornucopias tokens in our wallet. I can see them. And now what we're going to do is discuss what we're going to now strategize with and how to move this into liquid finance. Okay, so now let's go into liquid finance.